guys welcome back to my channel happy fashion friday i am at the mall <laughs> uh it's so perfect for this timing because you guys know i wanted to kind of complete my living room get some nice accents and you guys had so many suggestions in my last vlog so i really appreciate that and that is why i'm at the mall i am going to crate and barrel and i also wanted to go to like urban barn um, and some other furniture shops and i actually okay so i went to urban barn yesterday i got a ton of stuff and then crate and barrel i just already know i probably will buy things too and i finally bought some bigger pieces for my living room so i I also want to show you that in today's vlog but if you guys have not yet subscribed make sure you subscribe to my channel lifestyle decor beauty mommy related content vlogs uh and i'm really excited for today's video i also have a mommy's day giveaway that everyone can enter so make sure you guys stay tuned for that giveaway throughout this video i'm really excited and i also just wanted to say i hope you guys have the most fantastic weekend all the mommies out there uh i do plan on relaxing and i will have a video out go up on monday but on sunday i am full-on just laying around and relaxing and living my best life so i'm really really excited for that uh, i just finished my iced coffee or else i would have showed you guys i also just did my makeup in the car and i was gonna film it but i'm actually meeting uh, Tina and Ben at the mall so I was like okay I gotta hurry um, but I'm using the Tanya's collection makeup bag which I love it's like my favorite makeup bag um, but yeah anyways I'm not gonna make this intro too long I think all the furniture home decor lovers are going to love this video um, okay they just pulled up right next to me that was hilarious um, but yeah we, <laughs> we are going to go furniture shopping and I'm really excited for today's vlog I think you're gonna love it if you're like home decor lovers like I said uh, but yeah let's roll it right in <laughs> Okay, first I need to make my iced coffee <clears throat> before anything. And I'm like seriously obsessed with this stuff. I've been buying the other one, but this one it just hits the spot. Like this is the best cold brew. It goes so fast in our house though, because Ryan's been drinking it too, and it's just so good. It's hard to open though. Okay. There we go. <clears throat> this is what pumps me up in the morning. And I've been really addicted to just doing iced coffees because I don't know, they're just so quick in the morning and easy. A little bit of milk. And I usually don't do like a full one because I try to have one in the morning and then I'll have one throughout the day. Um, it is good though. I quickly wanted to show you guys what the girls made me for Mother's Day. Look how cute. This one is Sophia's. There's like a little handprint. She kept telling me, she's like, look how much glitter there is, mama. She loves nails just like her mama. And then that's what it says there. Happy Mother's Day. And Mia's is so different. They're just so different. Like any artwork that they do, just everything in general. It's just the cutest thing. Uh, so that one is Mia's. And these are just adorable. I'm gonna keep these forever. I like have been collecting a book of just all their artwork and I have it in my office. I wanna like laminate the pages or something cause I don't want like anything to fall off and I just wanna keep them forever. They're just so cute. But let me know in the comments down below what you guys have planned for Mother's Day. I'd love to know. Okay, I am gonna start off with Crate and Barrel Haul just because I am overly excited about everything I got and then I will get into all the other stuff. Uh, but this is just basically a long haul vlog, which I know you guys enjoy and home decor and just like little things for our house. So I'm really excited. I like never know where to situ or situate you guys when I'm filming in my kitchen, um, but I've just moved my chair. So I thought I would just show you guys like this because we have all the bags here. Um, what should I start with? Okay, so. 
Yeah, let's do this. Okay, I was so excited for these. You guys know I love wine glasses. And as one breaks, um, <clears throat> I got white wine glasses because we actually have a lot of red ones that we got when we moved in here. If you guys remember a long time ago when I did like that massive crate and barrel haul, all of our uh, glassware and a lot of our kitchen stuff is from Crate and Barrel. They have like phenomenal prices. I would say their furniture is more expensive, but when it comes to like their kitchen, like hardware and um, glasses, Tupperware, kitchenware, like all that stuff's pretty affordable, I find. Like, I think these were like $11 each, if I'm correct. La, la, la. Um, I will link everything down below. I don't remember the prices on everything, but this was like 11, I think, $11. Um, but they're really nice. I just, I loved like the size of them. They're smaller than some of the other ones that we have. And I don't have like nice white wine glasses. So um, I was really excited about these. And I got four of them. So I usually just get things in sets of four just in case we have guests over. They actually have an insane amount of glassware there. Like there was a whole, I don't know if I got a clip of it, but there was a whole wall filled of different ones. I actually kind of want to get the champagne ones, but I have like the, the really skinny ones, but they had some other nice ones that I like. I just, I don't know. I like having nice stuff for like when we entertain and you guys know we do entertain quite a bit. So it's nice to have that. Okay, so I've got those and then let's get this. So this right here, I actually picked this up after I bought everything and I was like, oh, I saw it. And I was like, I really think this would look beautiful in our house. So I was asking Tina, I was thinking of putting it in my dining room, like as a centerpiece, but yeah, this is the vase. That's what it looks like. It's really neat. It's not as heavy as I thought it would be. It really scares me having heavy stuff in the house because the girls, like I have, hold on, I want to show you guys <laughs> that I have. This is like the scariest thing because they have like almost dropped this thing so many times they actually put stuff inside it. I usually use it just for events and put like big pompous grass in it or something and florals and stuff like that for birthdays. But I should really just get rid of it because it scares me so much. It, yeah, you can even see like a little bit of like the wall. I think I have a picture to insert of when I saw it. It's really neat too. They put these... um these handles on the bags look at that it's just so much easier to hold there we go uh but okay so we've got okay so the reason why i got these is because they actually have like the little olives so this will match the big tree that we plan on getting in the or that i already bought um for the living room so and this is how it was in the store and i was like that's so pretty i just love it so nice that's what it looks like so ooh, i don't know i kind of like it in our kitchen too i think it would look good anywhere honestly it's just like such a nice pop of color i don't know if you guys do that i'm trying to get better at that but like sometimes i see stuff and i don't even know where it's gonna go but i just buy it in hopes that it will look good somewhere I'm bad at that because i just fall in love with so many things when i'm shopping uh oh okay so ooh. Okay, so Ben actually found this for me. It was really funny, but uh, I got something pink and it's so beautiful. And it was the only thing in the store. The lady actually said that, I don't know why, but like someone actually returned it and they were like all sold out of this. And it was like the very last one. So like, yeah, I got it. <laughs> um, let me show you. Do want that to fall? Okay. Look at this. Okay, hold on. I have to get closer to you here. It is a pink and gold pen, you guys. It's so nice. And okay, so secret here. I have like wanted a pink pen for a while, like to be honest, a whole collection, but there's always such like hit and misses with it online. Like if you go on Amazon and like, I know Paris Hilton has one and like there's so many different ones that you can find and see, but like, Crate and Barrel has some of the nicest pans. So I'm like, if I'm gonna get one, I wanna get one that's actually good and not just because it's pink. So she was like raving about this and it is fucking nice. Like it has like a handle right here too. Um, I will open it after just to show you guys, but that's what it looks like. Even the gold, like I love the gold too. It's like brassy, it's so heavy, it's so luxurious and I love it. So it's called the limited edition blush with the green pan. 
um, the other stuff I got here, <coughs> sorry, I'm losing my voice here. Um, I got this, so I thought this would be really nice for like snacks or charcuterie um, on our deck. So this is actually their patio collection stuff. So it's really lightweight. It's not like a heavy, um, heavy platter, but I just thought that would be really nice. And I liked the color. And then of course I got the matching, um, I got the matching plates. Like I love this color. So here, I just want to show you guys my, like if you look at all the tones that I have in the house, like this really nice, like sandy color, like all of this kind of goes, you can kind of see my vibe now. It definitely is like boho, uh, but these are really nice. Like they just feel so nice. And um, the ones that we have currently for our patio are marble and it just doesn't go with anything. Like even the browns and the cream colors that we have out there, it just didn't like work. And these I think were 12 bucks each or 11, $12 each, but really nice. So I got four of those for me, Ryan, the girls, and then, um, I think small, oh, and then I also got these smaller ones. So I got the smaller one, I also got four right there. And then, okay, so I was really excited about this. Uh, hee hee hee, you guys know I love my coffee mugs, like, see me there we go i love my coffee mugs and i'm really hoping these aren't orange color yes okay uh but i ended up getting these ones and they're so nice Ooh. okay so that's what they look like and they have like a nice weight to them and they're just really a nice coffee mugs i loved the color um i don't have mugs actually in this color so like surprisingly a lot of the ones we have are like the clear ones from crate and barrel and then, what other ones do we have? A bunch of like different miscellaneous ones, but not like classic, nice, everyday coffee cups. Like I think these are gonna be really, really nice. Um, okay, so I'm running out of room. Boom, 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 boom. Wah. completely forgot about these too. Okay, so these are little baby espressos because sometimes if we are super tired, we will do a shot of espresso, just straight espresso um, from our Breville. So the Breville we have is the touchscreen one. I'll also link it down below because I get so many questions about our coffee machine. The one I have, I really, really like. Um, and Tina and Ben actually have it too and they really like it too. So um, I highly recommend that one. I think ours is 13 to 1600 I can't remember how much it is now because it was it's a different price than what we bought it for we've had it for like I think four or five years um okay is this dirty yeah this one's a little dirty oh okay look how cute I can't can we not focus on me can we focus on the cuteness of the espresso cup there we go boom I don't know why my camera does that sometimes. And then this one, look how cute. I'm just obsessed with these. These are just, this would be a really nice like gift idea for a coffee lover. Like I'd love to receive one of these. Um, okay, is that it? That is it you guys, that is everything. So I'm gonna show you the pan. Might as well show you guys a nice close-up of it, but look, it's so beautiful. I don't know if I can hold it with one hand. Oh, yep, okay. We are going over here because I want to show you what it looks like on the stove. Oh, wow. Let's see. Oh, I love it. It's so nice. I actually, you guys, surprisingly, I don't own a pink pan. This is my first pink pan. Uh, the only thing I have, I have like some pink and gold spatulas, but... I don't have a pink pan, so this is so pretty. I love it. So nice. And some of the other things that I got here. So we have the little espressos. We've got the new mugs that I got. And then also the outdoor patio set. Uh, everything will be linked. I'll look for everything today and make sure that I have all the links for you because I know you guys like to just be inspired and get things for yourself too. And um uh, it's nice when you can actually see them in people's videos and stuff before you buy them. So 
this vase too. I'm so happy I got this. It's so pretty. It's it's a piece too where I think it honestly would look good anywhere in our house. So I'm happy I got that. And then I am going to show you everything else I got, which I actually filmed this yesterday, but we've got lots more stuff to show you. Okay, so the Mother's Day giveaway portion, I wanted to go big with this one. So we are doing, I'm doing $300 cash. Uh, so I usually just do it through PayPal. Um, some people like Amazon gift cards, like however you want it, I can send it that way. So $300 cash and then also $200 gift card in my store. So that includes the mini backpacks, all the accessories, the brushes, the makeup, everything. So $500 total. And I'm really excited because I feel like I do giveaways a lot, which is like my products, but I like to like give back to you guys. And the reason why I do like cash ones is then you can get what you want. And if I do a specific store, if it's Crate and Barrel, like maybe you guys want to get yourself something else for Mother's Day, um, like a massage or, you know, whatever. So I just thought that would be nice. Let me know in the comments what your favorite memory is with your mom or being a mom. You don't have to be a mom to win this giveaway. This is open for everybody, but I'd like to hear like a memory that you've had with your mom or being a mom. So let me know in the comments, just like one of your favorite moments, memories, uh, and be subscribed. And that's it. I make my giveaway super easy. The winner is going to be announced on Monday. And okay, you guys, so I have a big, big haul. We have a lot of home decor, which I'm so excited about. And it's one of my favorite stores. I just, oh, I love everything in that in that store and how they have everything set up in there. It's just, oh, you know, I could spend a lot of money in there. So I definitely left it a good time. I Here we have pompous grass and this is all over my house. It's from Urban Barn, if you guys were wondering. And I got more of the white fluffy ones. So these here, they come in sets. I usually get three or four if you have like one vase and they are so beautiful. They are in my kitchen. They are right here in our living room. There we go. And then there's some in my office. They're literally everywhere. And I just find the quality is so good. So one of these is 16 bucks. So I did get three of them. Paul, I picked up this bag. I just thought it was so cute. It's like, um, one of these little crossbody bags. So it comes with a strap right here. And I just thought it was adorable. I know these styles are really in right now. And I will leave a link down below. So you could do like the long crossbody like that or the shorter way. But I like the crossbody way. This kind of was getting me excited. I think I ordered this when I was in Canmore and it just like, I don't know, it's a nice like weekend bag or like a little trip bag. I thought it was really cute. I saw this and I was like, yes, this will be perfect in our house. <gasps> oh, it's so pretty. I just can't, look at this. It is stunning. So I got this beautiful vase and then I thought, it'll stay for a second. I got these three florals right here, which I thought would look really pretty in them. And then these each, wow, these were $20 each. Holy moly. Okay. I did not know that, <laughs> uh, but they do look really pretty in here. So I'll show you what that looks like. I definitely have a vibe, you guys. So I usually just buy everything that's white in the store. As you guys know, I'm like, where's all the white? Uh, so I just, oh, I loved the, the texture on this. It's just got such a neat pattern and design. And it's like, I can feel like some of the, um, I don't even know what you would call that. It's like textured though. It's really neat. So I have that and I don't know where I'm going to put it yet, but I will figure it out. Maybe the kitchen got, I got this patio rug now. Okay, so we have that, like that big seat we have that the girls sit on every summer, that's cream tone, like that's beige. But the rug I bought is silver. So I don't know what I was thinking with that. I might actually, my friend Tina suggested if I bring the rug, I'm just gonna show you guys because you're probably like, what are you talking about? Zoom in, we don't exactly have it up right now because it's been raining the last few days, but I bought this rug. It's from HomeSense, as you know, like I think a few vlogs ago. Uh, the tones are not matching. So what I could do, she was like, if you guys do a picnic or like if you and the girls are ever out on the grass, like you could lay it out on the grass and that would be nice. So I think I might put it away and then get like more of a beige toned um, rug because I mean, there's beige in the seats that we have. There's also a lot of like beige in the cushions that we have. So I just think it makes more sense. Hi, Maxie. <laughs> I have to take him on a little walk after this, you guys. Look at him. You see him? Say hi, Maxie. Hi, Maxie. 
the more I look at this, the more I'm just like so in love. I actually love the way this looks. So pretty. Okay, I'm gonna get back to vlogging here. All right, all right. Ooh, this is kind of like beachy. I just loved um, the the designs and the patterns on these rugs that they had. I didn't see this one, but I just thought the colors would make sense because I'm going for a little bit of a beachy boho in our house. And then this is actually, it can be like an outdoor or indoor carpet. It might actually be nice by the patio door. So I'm gonna try that in a second here. But here's a look at that. I think this was like $65 or 85. Get ready for this. And the reason why I go to this store, I'm kind of close to it, so I just always get suckered in whenever I go grocery shopping. I'm like, okay, maybe I can stop at Urban Barn for a little bit, especially if I'm getting gifts for like birthdays and stuff, which I will show you guys from Marshalls, but everything is near, which is not a good thing, but I can go crazy at this store. So this was 40 bucks. I mean, could you find something cheaper somewhere else? Probably, but I just fell in love with it when I saw it. And then they have everything so nicely set up in that store and it's just, yeah, it's uh, dangerous, so. Um, you know what other store when the girls were born? Um, is it Urban? No, Pottery Barn Kids. Oh my God, if I go in that store, that is the most dangerous store. I just poured myself a nice white, white glass of wine. I don't usually drink white, but I mean, a little pre-dinner glass of wine. And when it's summertime, I definitely go for white. But also, I was gonna say wine glasses. They had such nice wine glasses there. I was honestly very tempted glasses. They had like glitter ones too that I thought were really pretty. And if you're into like black right now, cause I know black and cream tones are really popular together right now, like the farmhouse, it's, they have so much stuff there. Like I was messaging my friend Tina a bunch of pictures cause she's, that's kind of like her vibe. Um, I would do more black, uh, especially because our exterior is black, but um, I don't know, you guys know I like light tones. I always like light tones. Even though the contrast is always nice, I tend to always just want to buy light tones. It's just my style, but I do like black here and there. Um, our basement actually is black, so like our bathroom is like that, um, it's like the sea blue and then black in there too because we have the sauna down there but i just like light colors up here i just think it's so pretty so yeah i oh look at this candle holder i don't even know where it's gonna go but i'm gonna put it right here right here so it's in the in the frame there we go okay. ah! oopsies okay so right here we just have a really nice candle it's kind of got like a neat design on it like a cream and white design so I saw it in the store like that and I'm like, yep, that definitely suits my house. And this was $5.99. I just thought this was like such a steal. It's just so nice and it's so luxe. And I was like, yep, I'm gonna get it. So I got that, not that I need more candles, but I think this will be a really nice like small decor piece somewhere in our kitchen. Wah, Marshalls. I was on the hunt for one of these, like a really large water bottle. So I got this, it was $24.99 and I like that. And it's a nice soft pink. I also got these shoes right here. I just thought they were so summery. And they looked comfortable, so that's what they look like. I am a big sandal girl in the summer. To Fia, these cute little baby hair brushes. Let's open that actually. Maxie, what are you doing? just like little ones. I thought those would be perfect to put in their bathroom. And then I got some Puma socks. Oh, these are like the little face wipes. I just thought, I know they're a little expensive, but I wanted to try these cause I, I don't know, the other cotton ones I usually use are just okay, but I, I heard these are really good and soft. So I started going in with toner a lot now. So I do need those more. We got a bunch of stuff for Preston and this was, the other gift I saw to get him an ice, or sorry, an air hockey table. So the girls had one of these and I think it was frozen and they loved it. So I was like, that's a great idea. They actually have really nice gifts at Marshall's for kids. And I wanted to get the girls, so I can't remember if I told you guys, I've had some issues with the girl's hair. It's getting really matted and tangled all the time. I mean, they're out in the sun all day long. They have sunscreen in their hair. So I just wanted to find a better shampoo conditioner because the honest one that I use, um, it's just like, it's not doing enough, I find. So my friend Tina told me that she was using this and it was super gentle. So it's the Bumble 
and Bumble Gentle uh, collection right here. So I got them the shampoo, it's a creamy cleanser, um, all hair types, and then the conditioner as well. And these smell so good. So I got those. And then for myself, I got these hair clips. They're kind of like a peach color. Uh, I got myself a new brush. I also, my friend Tina had one of these wet brushes in um, Canmore. And I was like, yes, I need one of those. So I got one of those. And then I got my eye cream for where I go and get my facials. This is like the best eye cream ever, the TNS. My friend Ashley got me hooked on this stuff. And I can't, I just can't go back to any other eye cream. And it looks like it has a really nice like jar too. Skin Medica, so good. I, oh, I love this eye cream. Okay, and then I am sweating. I also got this, so um, I've been using the Illumier collection. This is the toner, the bright and clear solution. She told me this is a really good product, so I wanted to try it out. I've been really liking the oil-free moisturizer and the exfoliating uh, serum. So, yeah, and then the two last things I got. So I got the Kerastase Elixir oil, which I really like. You can put it in your hair wet or dry, and it's not like overly thick like Moroccan oil. It's just nice. I like it, and it smells really good. And then also the Ultra Rich Deep Conditioning Mask. I wanted to try this out. Um, so yeah, that is all the hair stuff that I got. What else am I missing? I think that's it, you guys. That was a lot of stuff. I'm gonna enjoy my wine. I'm gonna start cooking right now and I will see you guys in a bit. My goodness, my battery dies every single video. I, def I, de I need to get more. I only have two and every time I have that issue. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed today's vlog home decor. Uh, let me know if there's any other stores you'd like me to haul from uh, or any recommendations. I would actually like to work on the bonus room next, which is upstairs on this side here by our bedroom. Uh, it's also not done. So have I ever showed you guys these pictures? I think I have, but I also really love these. They're so beautiful. Uh, and where else? Yeah, they're in our master bedroom too. I got them from the same company. Um, but anyways, I'm so, I'm off track, but I definitely have been into home decor right now and just like finishing off this house. Uh, so let me know if there's anywhere else that I should shop, but I hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you enter the Mother's Day giveaway. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, subscribe down below and also push the notification bell because if you guys get notified for my videos every Monday and Friday, then I will see you guys every single week, which will be awesome. Um, lifestyle, decor, beauty, mommy content you guys already know uh but yeah i hope you have an amazing day and also an amazing weekend i will see you guys on monday I, 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 I,